Hi everyone! In this video we will show you how to generate text on user's request in our Embracadero Delphi FMX app via OpenAI API GPT models. Today artificial intelligence can be used to solve different problems. For example, modern AI based services allows us to do adequate text translation into different languages. It is possible to generate various images and even videos on user's request. You just need to present request in a form of text and then transfer it to specialized service. Google Speech Services allow us to convert human speech into text. OpenAI makes it possible to generate human speech based on text entered by user also. So let's look at generating text on user request by using OpenAI GPT models capabilities in our Delphi FMX app. To use these capabilities, we need to sign up. Just go by link and click sign up. We can create account or use existing one. To sign up using Google account, just select continue with Google. Then select our Google account. To work with OpenAI, we need to generate API key. For this purpose, go to API key tab. Then click Create New Secret Key. Type key's name. And click Create Secret Key. Here you need to solve some puzzles. So, our key successfully created, but further using this key in our Delphi FMX app, we will copy this key and save it. Just click copy. For security reasons, API key is available for copying once. The next time you log in, this key will not be available. To go to API description for text generation, click documentation tab. Then select API reference. Then we will select chat. As an example, we will provide description of text to generate via OpenAI API and get JSON response with our generated text in our Delphi FMX app. Also, we extract generated text from JSON response. To work with OpenAI, in easy way, we developed special class to chat GPT. This class contains constructor. It takes NetHttp client object and send constant OpenAI API key as input parameters. OpenAI API key contains our API key. For my JSON function, presents our JSON response from OpenAI in readable form. Then text to chat GPT method takes string constant text as input parameter. Constant text contains description for our generated text by using OpenAI API. If NetHttp clients post method takes URL to perform post request to OpenAI. Also, if NetHttp clients both method takes multipart form data object class to multipart form data and dynamic array headers as input parameters. Multipart form data contains user request for text generation. Array con headers contains headers such as authorization with our API key and content type.
multi-platform data. And our array headers. Authorization with our open IE API key and content type application JSON. G -ob object contains such parameters as row and content. Content contains users' request for text generation via OpenAI. GR object class to JSON array contains array messages with our JSON request for text generation via OpenAI API. Job shout object class to JSON object contains the JSON request for text generation. Here we also pass such parameters as model, GPT model version. Messages and our generated text accuracy temperature. We pass here zero point seven value. JSON response from OpenAI will store in response content object, testing stream class. Then text to chat GPT method returns JSON response in the form of string. Message content from ChatGPT method allows us to extract generated by OpenAI text from JSON response. It takes string constant JSON answer, which contains JSON response from OpenAI with our generated text. This method returns only generated text from JSON response in the form of string. To work with OpenAI by using POST request in our Delphi FMX app, we'll use NetHttp component from ByteMNet. User can type request for text generation via OpenAI by using TMemo component. To show raw JSON response from OpenAI and to show only generated text, we will use the memo also.
Let's consider OpenAI API Text Generation feature in our Dell FFMX app. In send request to GPT button, on click handler will declare GPT helper object, I chat GPT helper type to work with OpenAI and send constant JSON answer to keep JSON response from server. Then we call the chat GPT class constructor and pass here two input parameters. First one, net HTTP client one. The second one, Eastern field, if open up a key with our previously saved secret key. In form on create method, we will pass our open AI API key. To avoid our app main thread blocking via performing push request, we will use the task. Also, we call send text to chat GPT method with generated text description from memo. To update the memo component state in main thread, we will use the thread synchronize. To extract only generated text from JSON response, we will use message content from ChatGPT method. It takes JSON answer as input parameter. Let's run our Delphi FMX app and test OpenAI API text generating feature. 